Joey, obviously, you know Akron's a great team every year. Um, you know, they, they scored relatively early. That's actually the first first half goal you guys have given up. And you could have been like, here we go again. But obviously, you know, you chasing those guys around for 80 more minutes after that. You kept them off the scoreboard and eventually got the tying goal. What What's kind of your mindset after you, you fall behind early like that? Yeah, I mean, you guys saw it. We make sure we just get in the huddle and kind of just talk things out, make sure that same uh, mistake doesn't happen again. And then we just keep playing. Like our coach says, it's a process. Um, throughout the game, it's 90 minutes. It's not 10. So once we know, like uh, we gave up a goal, we knew we just had to keep uh, pressing them, keep getting in good spots, and eventually our chances would come. And what was that energy like after that goal by Andrew in the second half? Yeah, it was good. It was great energy. I mean, at that point, we felt we were on them for a little bit, so we thought we could definitely get another one. I'm lucky to not get another one, especially after the red card. But uh, we'll just bounce back next time. And we'll make sure uh, we win. And I kind of touched on that same point with Coach. When you're coming into Mac play, there's a lot of pressure there. How do you guys handle that? Yeah, I mean, our we always talk about the connections and relationships that we have with each other. Make sure we're relying on each other for those connections, uh, re relying on those when we're playing soccer. And that kind of is our foundation and kind of what drives us forward. So that is how we kind of deal with pressure. Um, you know, you guys got – you always get good contributions from guys off the bench. But, you know, a couple guys, Kyle Blassen game. Yeah. You know, hasn't played a ton. Yep. Um, you got good minutes from him tonight. And then Eli made the play to get the ball to Andrew yeah. on the goal. Just, I guess, I know you see those guys every day in practice, but what's, what's it mean for you guys when guys come off the bench like that and you guys don't drop a step? At yeah, all? yeah, that's the main thing. That's with us. Like, we don't expect just because you're on the bench doesn't mean that you're not good or whatever. You can always make a contribution to our team, especially when you get on. And I think with our subs this year, a lot of them, once they come on, they make a big impact, especially Marco and some other guys. Chafe, all of them do really well when they come on. So we always have the idea of that next man up mentality. Two people go down, like for example, Beto goes down, Abdi fills in, and not a step is dropped. So just that next man up mentality is what we always talk about. And then I know I know you want to get a result. Like obviously yeah, you're not course. satisfied with the draw, but you, it feels like you guys are playing really well. Like the record's not indicative of how you guys have been playing. No, definitely not. No, we need to just touch up on some things. We keep talking about it. Like we said, it's a process. We're going to continue with the process, and we'll start getting some wins. Awesome. Thank you, Joey. Appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Thank you.